Okay, so we're gonna melt down some aluminum. And this is my homemade uh, forge or foundry or whatever you want to call it. This is what I did here. Welded this piece on. We've melted down several. Last thing I melted down was a bunch of copper. And uh, just the last of it had it here. So I just got the Harbor Freight weed torch that hooks to this and screws in and out here so you can adjust the temperature and see if you can see in there what I got going on. She's got the number 60 hole or whatever in that piece of copper that goes through. And then this thing just clamps on right there and just down to adjust your airflow going in. That was very important. I couldn't just leave it open, it wouldn't run. So we're gonna melt this stuff down. Um, we're gonna head up camping this weekend. I'm gonna take this with me and we're gonna we're gonna try to do some anthill castings. So let me get this thing fired up and we'll see how it works. Alright, so we just hey, don't get by it, it's back up. So we just got it started here. Um, running. guy gonna help me okay say bye-bye bye -bye. okay so we just put a I got a couple bags of aluminum cans in there now we're melting down this channel <laughs> slowly going down in there let me see here yeah they're melting right down in there good so just keep adding these in there till they're gone and we'll pour these out into a mold and then see what we All get right, so a couple of these I didn't notice they got they got some plastic running down through them and that's where we're getting all this smoke from. But it's just oh we got a few left. It's eating right through them. She's about full. I'm gonna have to pour here before I put any more in. So we'll let this bake for a minute. All right, so scraping the stuff off. Down the 
back up, Tanner. out pretty cool. Yeah. Probably should be able to get two more loads like that. Okay. Here comes the rain. Yeah, I feel it. Come look in there.